Welcome back to Oklahoma siblings are making us all feel like slackers today. Elijah Muhammad is now the youngest graduate from Oklahoma City Community College at just 13 years old with an associate's degree in cybersecurity. And before Elijah graduated, his sister Shania held that title at age 14, and she now has a bachelor's degree at just 15 years old. Shania and Elijah are both here now to share their success secrets. Guys, you guys are really making us all think we need to work a little bit harder here. Um, Elijah, how, how did you do this? How did you graduate with an associate's degree at 13 years old? Well, my dad has his, um, a, a homeschool program called Prep One Collegiate Academy, and it basically accelerates your learning into things that you're interested in. So since I was interested in cybersecurity, it accelerated me in that, which I was able to go to college early. So what was the reaction from your classmates when they first saw you attending classes, clearly so much younger than most of them? Well, they first thought I was like uh, someone was babysitting me and I was uh, with like another adult until I was like, I told them that I was actually in this class and my age. And they were surprised at first. And then they really didn't, well, they I didn't think they would think I would ask questions or they thought I would just be quiet in class. But when I asked questions and I was interactive with the class, they were more surprised. Now, Shania, you earned two associate's degrees last year at just 14 years old, and now you have your bachelor's degree in family and consumer sciences at 15. So uh, how did that all go down? And uh, um, do you guys work together at all when you study? Yes, we work together uh, quite often. So once uh, I started, once I started college and everything, of course, um, he was very inspired by what I did. Um, I got my associate, I got two associate's degrees at 14 years old. Um, and I kind of did the same process he kind of explained. And that's why I just went on to do my bachelor's. Uh, I completed everything in two and a half years. So I was, I was kind of, you know, just, just kind of just exploring more, doing, just going into it and just having fun. But it, it turned out quite amazing. Now, Elijah, you're the youngest of five siblings. Are you all competitive with each other? What are the family dynamics like? And what do you think is the secret here? Um, yes, we are competitive, but we all help each other. So we're competitive, but when someone else needs help, we all, we're all there to help each other out. Shania, I, I imagine when you're in a classroom and you're the youngest person there by a lot, it, it must feel a little bit intimidating. What's your message to others who might, you know, be doing something, whether it's academic or elsewhere, where they feel like, oh, maybe I don't belong here, or maybe this is too big of a goal for me? Um, my key message is really walk into your purpose whenever you are doing what you are meant to do it really doesn't matter what no one else thinks of course i have my doubtful thoughts but once i realize what i'm really doing and the impact that i am making and spreading my story and inspiring other lives then i realize this is where i'm supposed to be this is where i belong even if others can't see that right now and of course i had to prove myself numerous times to show that i am capable although i'm young although i'm the like the youngest person in the classroom, but having your abilities and skills speak for themselves is a, another big thing that I use. So I always put my work, my best work out there to show like, I know I'm young, but this is the reason why I'm here. I didn't get here just by doing regular old stuff. Um, so just putting out my best work and walking into my purpose and not really paying too much attention to what others think or say negatively, you know, about the story. Awesome. Well, Elijah, Shania, Muhammad, thank you both. Huge congratulations to you both. We will be following your thank stories. You. Thank you. And you can find thank more feel-good stories at goodmorningamerica.com. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.